All right, welcome back to This Is Your Life, and I'm Queen Vaisha Tarot, and today I will be doing a reading for Virgo. All right, Virgo, whatever comes out, comes out. I'm going to start with some oracles. It is Friday, July 26th. What's going on with Virgo? Cards, please, for Virgo. Hmm. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. All right. Virgo, I see you. Virgo, this looks nice so far. Can I get um, some more cards for Virgo? What else you got for Virgo? Okay, Virgo, so your oracles, you at the um, bottom of the deck, you have um, financial health. Then after that, you got new beginnings. You got confidence, lighting your load, happiness, and closure. Like, this is pretty excellent for Virgo. Because the, the reading is never, it's not often positive, you know, for some of the Virgos. But this is really good. You have a, um, a new beginning. And right up under the, the new beginning, the tarot card is the page of Pentacles, um, Virgo. And it says manifestation, reflection, um, financial opportunities. You got financial um, health right here. So... Um, when it comes to um, being wealthy, healthy, whatever the case may be, your um, health is going to be just as good as your um, financial blessings that's coming your way. You got um, good news and information coming your way. Right here up under confidence, you have the um, two of pentacles. So it's more um, earth coming out of here, Virgo. And it says um, multiple priorities. Um, time management and juggling and balancing and decisions and weighing your options. So it looks like you finna have a lot going on. It definitely looks like it has something um, to do with your your money. You also you also got the um, the six of Pentacles. So we got the Page of Pentacles, the Two of Pentacles, and then we got the Six of Pentacles. And up under the Six of Pentacles, we have um, lighting your load. So it says giving, receiving, balancing, sharing wealth, generosity, um, gifts in abundance and prosperity. So if a door has closed for you recently, Virgo, because we do have closure right here. If a situation has ended or something like that with closure being here, it, it needs to close because you're going to have good, you're going to have um, new beginnings and they want you to be confident in this. And whatever it is, it's going to relieve some stress that you may have been under, um, Virgo. And it's also going to bring you happiness, whatever this is. 
It's going to bring you happiness. It doesn't have to um, do with your finances, but I'm thinking it that because no, really, no love cards or nothing like that came out. Um, I think it definitely has something to do with your money. So if you would have thought that um, an opportunity has passed you by, maybe it did pass you by, but it wasn't for you. You got something good coming to you. Um, you'll probably, one, two, three, four, five, six, you'll probably know something within the next seven days, Virgo. You got the emperor here um, at the bottom of the tarot, and it says leader. So I don't know if you're going to open up your own business or going to be um, in a position where you're going to um, have a majority say so when it comes to a business adventure or something like that could just be a, a higher paying position at your job whatever it is you're gonna get more but work less something like that and you're gonna like it and um right here you have the seven of um wands all right and it says challenges and um competition and um what it says, maintaining control and holding your own and standing up for yourself. So this is this is really good. And that could probably be where the confidence card came in at. So it could have been a situation at the job or just in general where you finally even took a stand and it's going to work out really, really good for you, Virgo. Okay, so I know this is kind of quick and simple, but this is what I have. <laughs> this is what I have, Virgo. I mean, because we're talking about money, it seems like we could be talking about money. Let me, um, here we go. Since we're talking about money, let's see what the shit. Oh, bro, come on. Okay, let's see what the um, angel of abundance have to say for you. So the first card that came out for you, Virgo, you have moonlighting and it says you can start working on your dream career part time while keeping your other job to pay the bills. Soon your dream career will take flight and fully support you. I told you, I told you, it's, yeah, you about to, you about to be right where you want to be, um, Virgo. With this card coming out, it's a new beginning, and you're going to be super happy about this. It's like you've been looking forward to it. And like I said, you may know something within the next seven days. Then we have positive um, faith and optimism right here. And it says you open the door to positive experience and opportunities with your positive expectations and energy. Do not allow negative energy or temporary setbacks to interfere with the path that you are on. Keep the faith and keep on going. Because mm -hmm. you're going to have challenges. You're going to have challenges. But that's coming to an end with closure being right here. You have new beginnings. They want you to believe in yourself and your load will be easier. Whatever been um, holding you down or heavy burden, whatever, it's going to be lifted up. And like I said, even if it isn't um, a financial thing, it could be something like that's going on in the family that's weighing heavy on you. It's going to come to an end and the outcome is going to be good for you. All right. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have... Have courage to ask for and accept help. It says, asking for help is a sign of strength. 
as is accepting it as it is offered to you. Very often when you ask God for help, prayers are answered through other people. Be sure to accept this existence as well as give it to others as you are um, guided. And then with the um, Six of Pentacles right here, you're going to be in a position where people are going to be looking up to you and you're going to be able to help them some type of way. Even if it's just them having questions at the job. Hey, can you come talk to me? I heard you're good at doing this and you know, you're approachable. Can you help me with this? It could be even be something like that. But whatever it is, people are going to be coming to you, asking you for whether it's help or just advice or something, but you're going to be in a position to do it. You're going to be in a position to do it. I mean, it's so fast. I mean, do we want to talk home about love? Do y'all want to talk about love? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to leave it right there. I'm going to leave it right there, Virgo. Um, I hope this made sense to somebody. With that being said, Virgo, this has been um, your reading. Hi, I'm Queen Von Shea Tarot. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And thank you. I'm out.